The new look Border League got off to a very good start at Pointer Park in front of a packed stand, marking the first competitive 15s game of the season. Kelso, newly promoted to the Premiership, faced a Peeble side from National 2, which featured former Hoyk hooker Matty Carrier returning to his original club this season. And it was Matty who put Peebles in front after Kelso took an early lead, with a drive-over try from Ewan Knox. Carrier literally had to fall over the white line, and he wasn't going to be stopped from there. The first two weren't pretty tries, and neither was the third of the game, when Roddy Guinea powered over for a converted try to put the visitors 12-5 up. Peebles scrum was working well, and their confidence was growing, but when Donald Anderson threw a long pass out to the left, up popped Archie Barber to intercept the ball, and he had a simple run-in under the posts, which Dwayne Patterson converted to level the score. Peebles lost captain Jack Harrison soon after for 10 minutes on the naughty step, after a reckless challenge on Hamish Tweedy. And in that time, some speculative passing out the back door from Andy Tate and then Hamish Tweedy saw Murray Woodcock gather and sprint home for another converted try to put the home side 19-12 ahead at the break. Kelso hit the ground running right after the second half started. A long pass out to Angus Roberts put him into space and suddenly there was daylight between the two teams with Kelso's fourth try, although no bonus points will be awarded this season in the Border League. Peebles at times were playing some good attacking rugby and James Dow enjoyed a lung-busting run down the park before Dwayne Patterson tackled him. Patterson was yellow carded for some reason during this incident, but when he returned, his quick throw in led to this try for Robbie Tweedy to seal the game. Peebles managed a third try through Matty Carrier at the end, but the spoils went to Kelso and it ended Kelso 29, Peebles 17.